The economy is wild. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good thing. I heard. <laughs> 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 Well, all right, that's a good thing. <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> Women are very active um, in that part of the world. I know that for a fact. I don't know why that is. Maybe it's something in the water, or maybe it's the nice weather warm weather or maybe it's a uh, cultural thing. I'm not sure, to be honest, you know, but I like it. Hey, man, hey, I wouldn't be complaining about it. <laughs> so I'm the last person that'll be complaining about an active woman. <laughs> the more the merrier. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Yeah, I hope you come on too, man. Yeah. Someone told me that black women are at the bottom of the sexual market, but they seem to be the most educated. Yeah, that is true. Yeah, that, that's true too. My phone line? Okay. You can call my phone. Uh, We can do that too. Okay, that's my phone line right there. 800-315-8203. <clears throat> we can do that. Evo or, you know. You. Yo. Yeah, boy. What's going on down? <laughs> What's going on? Hey, how's it going over there? <laughs> it's crazy over here. Oh, my. I'm not going back to him. <laughs> <laughs> going back. Let me say something, man. Let me say something here to Columbia. I know for a fact that this is the matrix. This is the matrix, yo. Why you say that? It's not just the matrix. Because we got you, everybody thinking on some race stuff. Everything black and white, everything is dealing with a uh, white women. Uh, and he, uh, we have to uh, uh, bow down to women. We have to like do that, uh, jump through hoops and do cartwheels and backflips to these women in America. And the thing is that you don't have to do that. I mean, you come out to these other countries like this, the whole train, the whole spike, the whole mindset will change. Oh, yeah. Guaranteed. Yeah. Guaranteed. Now, everything happening in America is messed up. I mean, I'm out here right now. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. My whole mind. I mean, I'm not saying it's perfect, but compared to where we are in America and we come over here, it's Nice. Yeah. Food, the water. I've seen fruits with seeds in them. The fruits not genetically modified. They got real fruit there. Yeah. Everything is perfect. The the women. Everything is good there. Hey, what? Hey. Hey, hey, you. Did you? How long are you gonna be over there? I'm staying. I'm not going back. I'm trying to. I'm trying to. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'm going to do everything I can to go to immigration. I don't want to do, I don't want to uh, go back. What can I do to stay here? Maybe I can just leave uh, the country and go to a local country and come back for the next few days. Yeah, you know, that's, that's, that's what a lot, that's what a lot of them dudes are doing. They'll stay 90, like 89 days and go to DR for a week and come back. Uh, I'm going to tell you something. He comes to a place like this, whether it's Columbia, whether it's New York, whether it's anywhere else in the world that you feel comfortable being. We don't want to leave. We stay there. 
there. There are people that have come back to me to help. I mean, America's probably not for a black man. Yeah. For black people in general, but especially for a black man. Yeah. I really want to come. I'm here. I'm here. And it's, 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 I don't even know how to explain it. It's, I, it's beyond work. It's beyond work. Oh, I, I know what you mean, brother. I know what you mean. <laughs> You don't got to. Wow. You don't have to explain it to me. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, you know, uh, oh my goodness! And people are nice too. They're pretty. I'm not saying that it's perfect. You know, when it comes to racism, there's discrimination. But people are nice. People are nice. They're nice. They're nice. No, oh yeah, 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 yeah. No, it, it, it's no perfect place. No, yeah. No perfect place. You have your. Real light skinned Colombian, you know, and then you got the dark skinned Afro Latina Colombian, where, you know, there's a little friction there. And then when I came there, a lot of them thought I was an like, Afro Colombian. So yeah. they thought that me being Afro Colombian or Black Colombian, Afro Latina Colombian, they thought uh, that's who I was. And when I started speaking, when they heard my accent, they said, oh, but this is a African American, you know? So, hey, you, so, you, you, speak, you speak Spanish? Yeah, I'm, I'm speaking, I'm learning Spanish right now, and I'm speak, I am do speak a little Spanish. Oh, that's good. I still have to learn the other I still have to learn the other way, I apply Spanish. That's good. Uh, I'm, that's learning, good. I'm, I'm learning how to speak Spanish. Um, yeah, so I'm, right now, I'm just relaxing, I'm chilling at a restaurant across the street. I have my apartment right across the street. The beach is only 20 minutes away. There are many, many beaches all around. 20, 30 minutes away, 15 minutes up here in Valencia, you know, um, Shakira. You see her video. I'm not sure if you guys know who that is, but Shakira, she's from here, she's from Valencia. Oh, I didn't know that. You know, so, uh, yeah, Shakira, she's from here. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. That's cool, man. So, so hey, yo, let's well, I'm really... keep, in, uh, yo, keep in touch, bro. Uh, you know, uh, like I want to, yeah. I want you to, you know, keep us updated what's going on over there. Because, <laughs> hey, so check, hey, check, hey, check this out. I know, um, uh, Columbia's supposed to be open up like next week. Uh, all the restrictions yeah. down, all, yeah. all, yeah, yeah, man. So, so that's, that's, that's keep in contact, bro. I want to. <laughs> <laughs> Place to stay. You want to stay for a month or a week or two weeks or whatever. Don't worry, I got your back. I'll hook you up. Man. I'll hook you up right here in Bottom Key. It's very hot up here. Hot, humid, 90 degrees, 80 degrees year round. Like, you're, I mean, the coldest it would get is about 70. Oh, yeah, that ain't nothing. Yeah, I, I, I like it. I, I like it warm. Really? Yeah. Yeah. So, you know, the, 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 uh, the common temperature here year round is. That's good. That's good, man. Well, thank you. Don't believe what everybody says. Even so called black people in America, they say negative things about how can they say negative things about South America when they haven't been here? And if they have been here, maybe they have, maybe they have good runners with some people, they made some mistakes. A lot of people from America. Especially with us, we are black Americans. We come to other countries like this, we don't know how to conduct ourselves. We don't know how to conduct ourselves. You have, you have to remember that we are in a foreign country. You know, if the country does not belong to us, we can't expect people to trade it to us. And that's what some people do. Like some people from, uh, some black Americans that come here, they feel like they want people to trade it to them, to people like children and everything else. No, it's not like that. That would happen by natural nature, it would happen. However, you come here, you know, you stay humble, at the same time, you know, show them that you're not going to allow disrespect. You don't want to be disrespected, but at the same time, you respect the country. That way, you go far. And a lot of people, some, some people, they come here, and they feel like they want everybody to bow down to them, and they do all kinds of messed up things, say all kinds of messed up things, they don't know how to roll, you have to learn the country. You have to know what you're doing. 
And you have to watch your back because not everybody in every single country is good. You got some bad people in every country. Yeah. You're trying to take them over the torch, you know? Yeah. So you have to keep that in mind when you come to the country. And if you keep that in mind pretty much, uh, you know how to roll, and, you know, uh, you'll be good. Put the extra effort in learning Spanish, learn whatever language you want to learn, but whatever is Spanish or Italian or any African language. Uh, you know, wherever you want to go, learn the language, learn the people, show, once you learn the language, it shows that you have an interest in the culture and the people. So, that's what they want to see. They see that, especially if you're black, when you're you're African American, and you learn learn Spanish and you speak Spanish, oh, you love you. It comes automatic. You don't have to force to ask people for respect. It comes automatic. Automatically will respect you. The African American or Black American coming from America and you speak Spanish. Oh my Lord! Yeah. So thanks for calling, bro. Let's keep in contact. No problem. All right. Yes, all right. Peace. Peace. There you have it, man.